January 1st is a special day not only for 2008, but for WMBD-TV. Today is our 50th anniversary. Our own Sarah Barwatz takes us on a walk down memory lane with some familiar faces of the past and present. Since WMED first broadcast in 1958, we've been committed to serving you, Central Illinois. Bob Larson, another good reason to switch to New Center 31. Our Bob Larson was here in the early years when the station was downtown. When I came here 36 and a half years ago, we were film. I mean, everything that we did in the newsroom was on film. People really remember me as the weatherman, as the host of Street Scene, as the host of Dialing for Dollars, as the host of TV Topic. Former WMBD reporter John Day was Larson Sr. at the time. He remembers a studio full of live entertainment, rotating sets, and live commercials acted out by anchors and reporters. At times, <laughs> things spilled all over the live set and broke everybody up, not only here, but at home. In the 70s, WMBD moved to its current home on North University. We really worked hard to find stories that mattered. Former news director Brent Lontine started working at the station in the 80s. WMBD always it seems to be the leader when it comes to breaking news events and being able to, to get to a situation and go live. Hi, I'm Kate Habecker. And I'm Chuck Collins. Coming up Monday on WMBD This Morning. In every situation, we've worked our hardest to keep you well informed, warm and dry, and even a little entertained. A little more fun. What's with the bowels and bladders of WMBD's control room? Story tonight. What does a donkey have to do with the forecast? <laughs> yeah. the masses... I'm the donkey I'm not, here no. this afternoon. <laughs> We've worked hard to leave an impression on you. In turn, you've also left one on us. We take away a lot of memories. We remember the stories we cover. A fist fight on the sidewalk. Two guys running for top prosecutor. Unbelievable. We remember an anchor with a quirky attire. Only wearing uh, a jacket and tie up here above, but down below they had on sandals and shorts. And we especially appreciate the friends we've made along the way. I've had the privilege though over the last 36 and a half years of the 50 years that we've been on the air to really meet uh, a lot of great people and to work with a lot of great people behind the camera and in front of the camera and they're too numerous to mention but uh, I learned a lot from all of them and I'll be in debt to all of them as long as I am here. Thank you Central Illinois for coming along for the ride. We hope you join us for another 50 years. In Peoria, Sarah Barwatz, WMED 31 News.